Okay, we're doing a little bit of rebar restoration here, holding up a two-story barn, and uh, we had a major crack here, opened up about a half inch, there's another crack down there, but we stitched them, but we're trying to hold this corner together, so we're pouring, we poured a, about a two-foot thick footing today, and we're going to have an eight-inch wall with rebar wrapping around here in the future. You can see the rebar that we put in before we pour the walls. This is the other corner of the foundation. This is another corner that we completed and we extended the pour a little further on that side. And this is the final corner, so all four corners did get wrapped with foundations, rebar, and rebar stitching to save the foundation. And like I said, holding up two stories at his barn. These were regular cracks, they weren't opened up too much but they did separate because of that corner and we stitched it with rebar to help mend everything together and we're back to our two foot thick footing and our foundation that's going to be added to that it's a nice looking barn they're going to repaint it and everything so it's got a lot of history to it the inside is going to be all repainted, redone. All the cows used to be over here in this area. This is a bull pen, I guess, years ago. They had a bull. I think they had horses on this side. But we uh, saved the building from falling down. We put up some beams, some sister joists up there. We added a header that didn't exist before. and We added all new studs to that wall. We put cribbing in here and lifted this side of the, this whole corner and then put new studs in here and saved this corner of the barn. Alright, thanks for watching this episode of Saving This Old Barn.